men in my family on the assembly line of high school dropouts, military veterans, and construction workers. I have never seen a construction site unless you count a messy desk of staplers, highlighters, and scratched out drafts. My hands don't work like the men in my family. The men in my family, strong men, southern men, use their hands to build, fix, create. The blue collar sentiments are a stark contrast to my graphic tees. My hands are artist hands. The type of hands that sketch, compose, create avenues out of dead ends. This is how I find my way out. If you read the lifeline of the head of my family household, you will find macho men holding two belts, hammers, wrenches, and screwdrivers as the management take off their work. This is how they fix things. This is how they solve problems. This is how they man up. Come on, my father says me as being too girly for winning that poetry contest at 17. Because I can still see the 18 year old me straining to turn the lug wrench on seven tires while my father stood over me telling me how I was and trying that hard. But if you want to call me, I should just stay in the kitchen. Because this sweat stained brow rained silent oh, insult. Now, take my hand, read between the lifelines, that lies a writer, a poet, a graphic designer, that two artists, mm -hmm. whose hands look too soft for certain traditions, come on, Lord, right. the not enough oil on my fingertips, not enough grip in his grip, too much emotion, not enough labor, my daddy gives me the side eye when I tell him I got work to do, these hands can't fix their stock, can't sandblast interior of your home, can't dig a hole deep enough to bury themselves from your typecast, but these hands are too yeah. tight, revise, free write, Maybe all our hands got more laboring to do. 